At the time, I felt, I felt really special, being the only kid that lived next to the Olympic Stadium. And now, I feel kind of small, a little bit small. Ten years ago, this is where all the action happened. And just behind the aquatic centre and the tree line is exactly my view of the Olympic Stadium and all the action. It was a pretty barren land while it was being built, but it kind of felt like the Olympics were growing up with me as I was growing up. I am lucky enough to see such a sight. Just look at the roundness. When I was in school at the time, we actually went in as the choir to go and unveil the lights. So we got to push the massive red button to unveil the lights for the very first time. And I remember at the start of the game, seeing the lights turn on and the fireworks at the beginning of the opening ceremony. It was kind of beautiful to know that I was a part of that. It was disheartening. It felt like a part of you was going to be knocked down and knocked away. But the fact that it's still here and it's still standing, it, it makes me happy. To build infrastructure is one thing, to, but to build a community is another thing. The blood, sweat and tears that have been put into what I call home has been absolutely amazing. And to know I'm just a little bit part of it, yeah, it's a really beautiful feeling. And it gives me like a real sense of pride.